Lilibet Cuenca Rasmussen, what is performance for you? Performance is a way to hum communicate with the audience in a very direct way where there is no filter between um, the viewer and, and the art. Um, and it's a very um, direct, direct way to, to, to reach uh, the audience with, with what I want to say, my art. Traditionally, performance was very much connected with the body. With a, body, with a simple body, the body used in a direct way. Your performance is a little bit different. You are more connected with the language of spectacle, dance, music, singing, poetry. Why you are using this kind of language? Do you think it's a more modern language? The most important thing for me in my works is actually to reach out to a lot of people. Um, and uh, one of the, the major things in, in the issues of in my art is to have, you can say in a very banal way, I like I have a story I want to tell, there's like a message I would like the audience to reflect upon, for example, feminism in this like piece I made yesterday. Um, here, um, or it could be racial issues, so or egotism or cyberspace. So it's like I'm using the text to to elaborate on this issue. I feel like the body is not enough. I need more layers, um, and also I'm like I'm educated in the the art world, the visual arts. But for me, the most important thing is actually to get out, reach out with, with my message and to using more like m maybe a more popular language and contemporary language like the MTV generation. I think I, it actually, um, I reach out to, to more people. I have also performed in venues like musical venues or theater venues and I feel like my work can be in a anywhere. It can be in the art, it can be in the music, can be the theater. Um, I want to be free of, of that, if you can say that. But one of my issues, I think it's very interesting to, to have this dialogue between the different artistic scenes. Like when I do a production, I collaborate with costume designers, I collaborate with musicians or graphic designers. And for me, it, it gives me a lot. I learn a lot from this and I, I feel I can extend my, my language. Um, so it's curiosity. Um, I love to do things that I'm afraid of. Like, <laughs> and I also feel that this is my language. I, I'm not it's very hard to do something that is bef done before, like you were saying, like body art in a very simple way. I mean, I, I feel this is not my, it's not for my generation. I want to try to move on. I don't know if I succeed, but this is one of the things that, to mix the languages. Gesamtkunstwerk, but that was already done before, of course. <laughs> yes. And uh, uh, you, in a way, consider that contemporary art system is not enough. And you do performance for, because of it. Do you think that performance can help to enlarge or to change the contemporary art system, to reach, uh, to find the new position of art in the society? I don't know. Um, that's a good question. I Actually, when I saw the program in Documenta, the last Documenta, there was a lot of people from the theater world, there was a lot of, so it's like, it made me very happy that the curator was involving so many people that it's not directly, it's more from the, the theater world actually, um, and it, it was, for me it was very interesting. Um, maybe it can actually, because performance is as I was saying before, like performance, there is like no filter between the, the audience and, and the artwork and, and um, it, it's really a direct communication and people, maybe for, for people who are not really in 
to the history of art and uh, um, it's a good way, it's a good entrance, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Mm, we, during this interview, uh, we made many mistakes and we recorded it more times. Is it a performance or a performance is when you do it directly? Uh, I think performance is when you do it directly and you have to improvise also on your mistakes.